he's a local Hood River favorite. And uh, always, he's very passionate about dancing and he's, he's incredible. Um, we all really appreciate Aram. And this is my dear friend, Elizabeth. She lives right next door to me. It's amazing how we found each other. Super grateful. Um, and yeah, I hope the husbands and wives will feel inspired by this when your wife is in the kitchen cooking. Just take five minutes, grab her hand, give her a twirl, and it'll make a world of a difference. I know you husbands out there are romantic and love your wives, so <laughs> this is um, some inspiration. Just takes five minutes, do a little dance in the kitchen, or um, when you're yeah, outside gardening. Because this is really, really special stuff. Be inspired. All right, let's see what we have. Or the beach. <laughs> or the beach, yeah. Wherever you find yourself. We've danced for a total of 20 seconds. Right, yeah. Right, in the kitchen, as you said. I've, I've danced since I was in college. Um, before COVID, I was driving to Portland twice, three times a week, dancing, dancing in several places, ballrooms. Um, uh, dance studios and other kinds of places and just it's plenty of exercise three four hours in an evening and I've got a lot of dancing in. and I also teach I also teach so Elizabeth has just started <laughs> and we're going to demonstrate beginning bachata bachata has in origin in the Dominican Republic. And they dance all the time. Everybody dances, everybody down there. Could you give them a, a little bit of a taste of the music? Okay. Maybe a sound check. So imagine that kind of a party feel. Okay? So we're, we'll start. We'll start by just swaying back and forth, and everything is relaxed. And now instead of one, we're gonna go two. One, and two, one, and two. Cognizant of the strings. One, and two. Great. 